if your Mac is going to sleep every 15 minutes or so and it's driving you crazy, uh, we can solve that. So let's go ahead and click on System Preferences. And you're going to look for the Energy Saver icon. It looks like a little light bulb. And you'll double click on that. And there's two sections here to be aware of. One is for battery and one is for power adapter, right? So depending on your usage patterns, you're gonna to want to adjust one or both of these, right? So under power adapter, uh, right now the computer sleep setting is for 15 minutes. I don't want it to ever go to sleep. If I have it plugged in and running, I want it to keep running, right? So I am going to say never for this. And of course, we get this lovely warning, your computer may use more energy with these settings. That's cool with me, I'll pay my hydro bill, right? So we go ahead and click OK to that, right? And then display sleep, uh, that's, that's still annoying. I don't want to set that to never because there is the possibility of screen burn, etc. cetera. Um, but uh, if, you know, if you're watching a movie or something, whatever it is, you don't want your display going to sleep after 15 minutes reading an interesting blog page or or just walking away for a few minutes so uh, i would say for myself anyway i want that to rarely happen but i do want it to happen if i forget and you know go on a holiday or something so uh, we're going to set it at three hours right now we do have some other options here uh, put hard disk to sleep when possible right um, depending on the performance needs of your machine, you can uncheck that. Uh, if you want everything to be always ready, like your hard drive to be spun up at top speed all the time, so that when you go for a file, it's there and ready uh, to respond. Um, generally, though, I wouldn't recommend that. That can uh, decrease the life of your machine uh, significantly because you're not going to be there. Generally speaking, most people aren't going to be there all the time just grabbing things or if you're there randomly, you don't necessarily need that micro difference in speed, right? But if you're running a business and people call in and they want information now or yesterday, you know how it can be, uh, you know, uncheck that box, right? And then uh, wake for network access. Um, that's a decent default. We'll go ahead and leave that checked. And the last option here, enable power nap while plugged into a power adapter. I am not going to turn that on because I don't want my computer, um, you know, napping so much as just, I just want it to be ready, reasonably ready to go, right? So uh, we've just tweaked the power adapter area. Now, we, as I mentioned earlier, we still have the battery area. So um, I might actually move this up to you know, say 20 minutes, but I would, for on battery, you do want your computer to, uh, you know, manage its power uh, more aggressively, because if you do get distracted, you know, someone comes to the door and then you can't get back to your computer for a long time, you don't want the computer just running out of battery, but not going to sleep before it does, right? You know, you could lose files and all that kind of thing. So uh, do set this at some kind of a reasonable level, uh, you know, short enough that you can be assured that you'll have enough battery power for it to get to that part or to that point, um, but long enough not to annoy you, right, while you're using it, right? So, and, and again, even here, the display sleep is only a couple of minutes. I would put this up to 20 minutes as well. Um, I still have a pretty decent battery. The, the other options are similar to the other. We don't have to go through those again. But this is how you manage uh, power on your Mac OS X machine. Thanks for watching.